we is big. <laughs> and I know y'all probably feeling like I been in y'all. I kind of did. I, I did. I ain't gonna lie. I kind of did. As far as the LP go. Um, cause baby life was life in and I just didn't have the time to really record. But we back. Okay. And y'all already know who we back with. We is back with no other than Miss Cassandra Gonzalez, baby. And her messy ass family. Um, so before we get into this. I've had some things change about my game. So let me address some of those things. Because y'all might be like, hold on, wait a minute. Something, something a little different, okay? Um, So Cassandra is not in the medical field anymore. Um, That's because of a mod that I have. It's, it's, it's not really complicated. But in order for the mod to work properly, she needs to be at least a level 8 in the medical field. And we all know she was not, okay? Sister Girl was one malpractice lawsuit away from being put in jail okay so she does work in a new career now um some things about the house have changed just small things like you know um but other than that everything with her life is the same like you know she's still feeling her new boo amari we still got beef with Derek and his new chick um which will be addressed during this episode okay don't you worry about it it's gonna be addressed because like we stated in the last part we very much felt like Derek was fucking with shorty while he was fucking with us the mad they mad they. so um other than that like y'all might notice like small changes here and there nothing too crazy um baby cassandra and lila have been shopping they got a couple new outfits you know it's almost time for us to um age akaya up so akaya will be getting aged up this weekend baby we excited so outside of all of that like i said i'm glad to be big i'm 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 gonna attempt to be consistent okay i'm i'm Listen, I'm back in school. If y'all be in my lives on Twitch, matter of fact, if y'all is not following me on Twitch, get there. The link is in my bio. Um, and so I do be going live. I just don't be going live playing with this family, but I do go live. Um, but yeah, we finna get into it and see what Cassandra got going on, baby. Is. let's see what's up with everybody needs y'all we have not been here with cassandra and her babies in a while so let's see what's tea with everybody so cassandra needs to eat lila is currently at work um both of her kids stink so we're gonna have her handle that first um we're gonna have her change elijah is he hungry he is all right so she's gonna change elijah and then we're gonna feed him and Akaya is asleep, but we're going to wake her up, change her, and feed her. Um, I'm trying to decide, really, if I want to follow Cassandra to work um, at this new job. Or do I want to wait until, like, the next work week? So, I don't know. We probably won't follow her to work tomorrow. Um, we'll just follow her to work during the next you know, following week or whatnot. Um... And then I'm trying to decide if I want to age Akaya up this weekend or if we should age Akaya up next weekend. I just really don't know. It may be this weekend because at this point, baby, we ready to age her up. Like, these kids been infants for way too long. Um, she And she finally got all her milestones unlocked. So we're going to age her up because she is older than um, Elijah. So we are going to age her up first. Um, girl, you just trifling throwing stuff on the floor. So, all right, so we got baby boy good and changed, and let's feed him real quick since Akaya is still asleep, so we don't have to rush or nothing like that. Um, let's get him a cute little bottle or whatever. Okay. Um. So yeah. So you know, um, the state that I am in right now. So I originally recorded the part that I needed went to edit the video and realized that like in the middle of the video the sound was gone so we're back recording it again um so that's why y'all gonna be late seeing this because i was supposed to be uploaded this but yeah so in the state that my game is in right now and at the time that i'm making this video the new pack the new love struck pack is out but my game is not updated yet. So, you know, some people may be like, well, you know, her game running smooth. Or they may be like, well, we don't see none of the new game features. I have not updated my game yet. So, um, at this point, I think I'm going to wait like another week or two. 
um to update because baby I ain't got time for EA and mess. I don't I don't have time for EA and mess. And then from my understanding, I haven't done much research because I don't usually start researching my minds until I'm ready to update. Um, but for what I've been seeing as far as social media and everything goes, um, a lot of the mods still ain't working how they supposed to. So, um, yeah, there's that. So, yeah, I'm gonna give it another week, maybe two before I, up, you know, upgrade. So, we gonna see a couple of parts without the new features and the new pack, um, for a little bit, but it's okay. So, we got her woke, and we're going to change her diaper real quick, and we're going to have him go ahead and go to sleep, like, which, okay, he's already in the process of trying to go to sleep, so yeah. Cassandra, come on and get this girl, change her diaper because she stank, and then we're going to feed her. Um, But yeah, like, if you've been in my lives, then you know that the doctor career is so fun now. Um, with this new mod that I use, uh, but I just figured, well, we figured out, like, during the live streams and everything like that, that in order for us to get this mod to function the way it needed to, I had to get rid of all my play sims as hospital staff, like, oh my gosh, she just peed on us, let me know. So, like, I couldn't have any of my, I could have only one sim, which is the sim that I'm playing with, be, um... An employee at the hospital so like you know how when cassandra was working there we had multiple of my sims working at the hospital well unfortunately we had to fire everybody <laughs> so the sim that i play with on live stream gianna she is the only sim that i play with that currently works at the hospital so because of that you know cassandra had to find a new line of work and you know what we really don't have no problem with that for real y'all because if you think about it um Cassandra asked, baby, like I said, she was a, a malpractice suit away from going to jail. Because, baby, listen, she, honey, she was in there fucking them people up. We're not even going to lie. She was in there messing them people up. So, yeah, it, it's we okay with her being in a new career. For whatever reason, Akaya did not want that bottle, baby, and she's hungry. Look, Cassandra, like, girl, you going you gonna to eat or you going to starve? What you going to do? Um, she's supposed to be going to put her in a high chair, but I guess they just gonna have a staring contest at this point. I'm cool with that. Just do whatever y'all need to do. Um, let's throw this away. Now, I told y'all I ain't Molly the maid. Now, I ain't, don't make it a habit. We helping y'all clean up y'all house because, baby, this ain't it. You know, you got a trash can. Yeah. Can somebody tell me if this is like this in their game? When... You have your Sims change their infants at the change the table. Baby, they they don't use that garbage can. So, what is it there for? They throw the shit on the floor behind them. So, like, what is the point of allowing us to snap a trash can to the change the table if they're never going to use it? I don't I don't understand that. Like, I thought once you did that, the animation would ought to be automatically be you change the diaper, you'll see them throw that shit in the garbage. But, no, they trifling ass is throwing them on the floor. I don't, I don't understand it. You know, but nobody understands why EA does the shit that they do. So, there's that. Baby, her ass is big as sauces. Do she like it? Because we need to know. But I don't know, y'all. That's usually a telltale that she don't like it. We gonna see. Maybe she like it. Maybe she don't. Because I think this is our first time giving her this game. Um, so, Cassandra is thirsty. We're gonna have her get some water on the second. But we're gonna let her finish feeding baby girl. And actually, after we finish feeding her, we are going to put her back to bed. Uh -huh. uh, okay, she liked it. Okay, good. Because we ain't got time for all that picky stuff. No, ma'am. Um, But yeah, so we're going to get her in the bed. And then Cassandra is going to have her drink of water. Um, And I do use the mod uh, where that allows your Sims thirst to be like a uh, mood lit so you can see when they're actually thirsty um and i use that with another mod that allows you to have functional water bottles so um your sim will have to fill their water bottle up um you can keep it in the inventory or not um and yeah so like whenever they get thirsty honey they will drink from their water bottle and there's a couple of different bottles um there's a hydro flask which is what she got I'm pretty sure Lila has a pink water bottle. There's a Starbucks cup. There's a Stanley cup. Um, 
And I know I'm missing one. I'm missing one. But yeah, there's, you know, those are the options for the cup. Um, so what's different is, you know, this table is turned a different way now because we had to make room for the washer and dryer to go out here um, instead of in the bathroom because I have Q&BB's laundry overhaul, which I live, okay? Um, so with her laundry overhaul in order, you know how her overhauls work if you don't know. Um, in order for your sim to do laundry, baby, they have to get some detergent. Um, and then if you upgrade your washing machine to have the additive tray on there, the additives you can use are the Downy Unstoppables or you can use a Tide Pod. Um, she also did game. So you got the game scent beads and then you have game detergent. And in order for you to dry the clothes, baby, you have to have dryer sheets. Like your sim has to have these items in their inventory in order for you to be able to wash and dry clothes. Love it. Um, so Cassandra is eating a bowl of Captain Crunch berries, y'all. Just, just get up. It's 11 o'clock at night. She's eating cereal, but don't knock it, okay? Because, baby, cereal is a, a universal meal. It's not just for breakfast. Um, well, in my house, uh, it's for breakfast. But I'm just saying, you can eat cereal any time of the day. Um, why is Miss Carla ringing our doorbell? Girl, go ahead on. We're not even finna answer the door. It's 11 o'clock at night. We don't know what Miss Carla wants, baby. Um, so at this point, we need to add these clothes to the dryer. And because she already has uh dryer sheets in her inventory, she's gonna automatically dry the clothes. Um, but if you'll see them don't have dryer sheets in their inventory, they will not stock the dryer until you get the dryer sheets. And the laundry detergent, and I'm pretty sure the unstoppables in the dryer sheets. You can buy in build and buy mode. Otherwise, you order them through uh, Q&BB's Express Delivery. Now, I want to touch on something about that. Because I see a lot of people say that her Express Delivery don't work for them. And it's all about installation and making sure you have everything installed right. But something that I also noticed is... So, the first order I placed when I got back to playing with Cassandra Neal for this LP. Because I had to do all this before I started recording the video. Um... I ordered the stuff and the Target box was delivered, but y'all, I couldn't open it. Like there wasn't anything in the box. Like it was almost as if um, the box was empty. So I ordered again. And that second time the box actually had the stuff in it. So I think what the issue was the first time the box was delivered when I wasn't paying attention. So I didn't try to interact with the delivery person. So the second time, Baby, I was watching that curb. You hear me? I was waiting for the person to show up. And I clicked accept delivery. And this time, I didn't get outside to them in time. So they just set the box down. But that time, the stuff was actually in the box. So what I will say is, if you have it and you notice that your issue is when you order stuff that your items aren't, um, aren't in the box... Try to order again and just make sure you see when the delivery person actually shows up and hit accept delivery and see if that might change it. Because I was like, bro, I'm going to have to keep buying the stuff out of building and buy mode because, baby, they keep bringing me empty boxes. Like, it's giving somebody trying to scam me. Um, So, she going to use her little Nivea uh, body wash also by q and BB. Um... And then when she gets out, I think we have the lotion. Yeah, we do have the Nivea lotion. So, baby, she's going to put some lotion on because y'all already know, honey, she's going to be crusty when she gets out the tub. Um, And then we're going to have her go to sleep. And I'm like I said, I'm still on the fence about if I want her to go to work or not because, you know what, we're not going to follow her to work. We're going to let her go to work. We're going to let her grab a hold it for this time. And what I want to do is I want to go through my world because I'm still kind of working on townies. I want to go through my world and I want to put other play sims in that position. So that way when we go to work, baby, we ain't got townies dressed like clowns. You hear me? Because, baby, they put on anything and think they be doing a big one and it, it be a mess. So um, why Lila got $2,300 in her bank account, baby? Where Lila getting all this money from? Let me find out her little drug dealer boyfriend giving her money, baby. Let me find out. But, you know, that's neither here nor there. Um... So, yeah, she she just enjoying her bath, baby. I, I don't think I've ever seen a Sim in the tub this long, honey. She said cleanliness is next to godliness, okay? 
So we just gonna have her go to sleep. Uh, let's see what Lila Lila got going on. Lila needs to take baby. Who work uniform? So somebody done put a bag of shit on my front porch. Mackenzie, don't let me find out it was you, girl. Because, baby, I don't even play like that. Like, that's the quickest way to get you punched. The quickest. Y'all know we is about that life. The quickest. It, it, yeah. Girl, just go ahead and go home. So, Lila going to pick this up because we don't know who left this here. I'm, Baby, I'm hoping somebody just dropped um, their packed lunch on my porch by accident. Because, baby... If I find out that's a bag of shit, somebody got hell to pay, okay? I don't know why Lila got these stockings on. Girl, Miss Ma'am, throw that away. Like, what are you even doing? I don't know why Lila got these stockings on when she go to work, but I promise y'all these stockings is not a part of her outfit. Sephora is trying to be funny because y'all know that's where Lila works at Sephora. And I feel like they're trying to be funny because why we got these stockings on? Like, like let me know. She needs to drink some water because she's thirsty, so... They just standing here when I tell them to do stuff. I don't I don't know what's tea, but um yeah. So Lila, any any day now. The game is not finna throw air because my time is not frozen, so I really don't know what's up with that. Um, Cassandra's sleep. She ashy as hell, like I told y'all, but she's sleeping. It don't matter. She can put lotion on when she get up. Lila, girl, do you just not want to throw it away? Ma'am, ma'am, excuse me. Excuse. Oh, okay. She she said, "Bitch, I'm thirsty. I'm not, I'm not trying to throw nothing away. I want something to drink, baby. That cup is huge. This is, I, I've never really paid attention to the pink cup. I usually use the Stanley cup or the Hydro Flask, so I never paid attention to how big this pink cup is, baby. That water bottle is huge, huge. Okay, Lila, listen. Could you just go do what I asked you to do, please? Like, you showing out in front of company right now, and it's really unnecessary. Like, I don't care if you don't like it." it I'm, I'm just saying baby we had to have a talk um so she finally taking out this trash um and then we're gonna have her take a shower real quick she did just get out work with these clothes dry let me see uh okay put this laundry away for us girl you just gonna take out every bit of trash in the house you know what go ahead we're not we we're not gonna complain go ahead and y'all, I'm actually going to, like, if you've been in my live, you know that I've been going around deleting these ring cameras because baby has gotten annoying. Like, at this point, I think I'm going to take the mod out because it's gotten really annoying with the people ding-dong ditching, like, it's too much. Or the people just walking up and making, like, faces in the camera. Shit. Baby, just leave the camera alone. Just just go ahead and worry about y'all business. Just leave it alone. Um, what is she? She definitely needs a vacation. Girl, me too. <laughs> All right, so we're going to have Lila go in here and put these clothes away, and then she's going to take her uh, shower. Um, Let's see. Let's take a shower after we put these clothes away. Excuse me, y'all. I'm yawning. Um, all right, so she's going to take a shower real quick. Let's see. Um, We're going to let her use her OG egg body wash, baby, period. Um... And then when she's come out, we're going to have her use some of this moisturizing lotion. Go put that on because I know you're crusty. Um, and we're actually going to have her eat like some noodles or something. Some quick, baby. She needs something fast. So let's see what we got. Sonic and Severinka, y'all. So this came out like at, way after I did the last part, obviously. Um, they came out with their own microwave. And then they have like their own foods that you can microwave. And baby, when I say I am here for it, I am here for it. So we just gonna have her eat some beef ramen and she just gonna drink like a bottle of water or something with her food. I think we got some bottle. Oh, you know what? She got something to drink in her inventory already. So we're gonna open that. Um, after she make up these noodles. Okay. So y'all look, like she got name brand noodles, baby. Wait, she ain't come to play. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, girl, put the noodles in the microwave. See, Lila, you starting to stress me out. You want to do what you want to do show instead of to do what I told you to do show. And it's just really not giving, okay? It's giving, you want to be sent to boarding school. That's what it's giving. And it's almost like, it's like y'all, Lila is 16. Like, her birthday is coming up. She's about to be 17. She's got the option right now to uh, graduate early. We just don't know. We just don't know. We just don't know how we feel about that. Like, I think we are, I don't know. Maybe we'll have her graduate when she turns closer to 18 so i know y'all probably like what you mean turn closer to 18 so look this is what i did with my um 
first of all, Miss Mamas, hold on, let's, 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 let's not eat the noodles. Could you put those in your inventory for a second? And then I'm gonna have her come sit at this table. Um, so the way I am doing the agent with my Sims. No, don't put it in the refrigerator. We'll get it out of the refrigerator for you. Because, like, you just took them out of the microwave. Why are you putting them in the refrigerator? Girl, go to hell. Um, but, yeah, the way I am aging my Sims. Okay. Let me, wait, let me take that back. Because y'all know I don't age nobody up. The way I am doing the, like, the Sims as far as them aging and birthdays and stuff like that, right? Because we realized something playing with Gianna on live stream. So, you know how... Lila's been a teen for a while now, right? But, like, we know that I'm not finna age Lila up to an adult no time soon. You know, her mom, if I'm not mistaken, I think Cassandra is still a young adult. Let me look and see. I'm pretty sure Cassandra's still a young adult. Let me see. Uh, or is she an adult? Yeah, she's still a young adult. So, she's not even an adult yet. So, um, Cassandra's still a young adult. You know, she was young without a free baby. She had these kids when she was young. She had Lila when she was young. So, Lila is currently 16. So what I have been doing is I go in and I pick a day that I want. Well, when I started doing this, I started doing it with Gianna's kids, Mariah and Adriana, because we knew when we aged them up. So the day that we aged them up, we made that their official birthday. So we made it as a holiday. So that way that day will always come around and we'll act accordingly when those days come around so we're gonna pick a day obviously because i don't know when lila aged up to a teen i don't remember so i am going to pick a day on the calendar um baby she told that food up okay i'm going to pick a day on the calendar that we're gonna set as lila's birthday and when that day comes around that'll be when lila turns 17 and then when it comes around again lila will be 18 and i'm assuming by that point like once we get close to lila turning 18 that's when we'll age um cassandra up to an adult you know because at some point you, you know once she turns 18 honestly i feel like 18 she's still a teen so let me know in the comments what y'all think like at 18 should we age her up to a young adult or she'll be out of school um, because technically she'll still be a teen. And should we age her up to a young adult when she gets to 21? Because like I said, their birthday is going to come around every, you know, season. Like, it's going to come around. Because I'm going to set it as a holiday. But I just don't know if I want to age her up to a young adult when she turns 18. Or, like, if I want to wait until she's 21 to make her a young adult. Let me know what y'all thinking. Because, yeah. That's, that's something I really need to figure out as far as that goes. So, I'll know, like... If we want to have her as a young adult or not. Um, so, yeah. There's that. So, Lila is watching her some TV, baby. Because she really ain't sleepy. What is she, let's, let's see what she watching. Oh, baby. They getting busy. She is watching Love and Hip Reunion. Period, sis. Heard you. She said, honey, I, I, I miss some stuff. I need to get caught up. Um, what's wrong with her brother? I am hungry. Girl, you ain't got a tent to him. Matter of fact, it's five o'clock in the morning. Since she got home from work Um girl go to sleep Y'all Lila is saving up some money Because Lila feel like you know She's getting older and she okay. wants to Redecorate her room so Lila been saving Her little coins from work And you know we give Lila a allowance Still um On Mondays okay. so she's saving Her little coin up baby because she wants To redecorate her room and we're gonna let her but that's going to be on her dime, okay? Because I'm just saying, baby, if that's what something you want to do, you work, yes, save your money, do that. You know, I'm going to help you if I need to. But for the most part, y'all, Ly Lila is going to finance uh, redecorating her room her own. Because she's like, baby, I'm an independent. I don't know what you're talking about. I'm going to do this by myself. Um, So Cassandra is feeding Elijah because he was fussing. Um, he needs to use the bathroom. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. Um... We really don't want to have to put him, like, back in his bed. We can put him in the, the playpen. Uh, let's put him here. No, see, she's going to put him in there, and I don't want to put him in there because then that means he's stuck in the room. Um, Miss Girl, you going to put 
18 Pogo. Yes, no, maybe so. Um, so yeah, we don't want him to be stuck just in his room. Let me change her clothes because, baby, I don't know what sis got going on. Could you just put a shirt on at this point? Like, that's like, please. Um, and y'all know for the longest, her and Akira was still somehow in a relationship. Never realized it. Um, they were still in a relationship. Girl, uh, is he still? He's not. Is he sleepy? Like, why does she keep crying? Well, she is kind of tired. Okay, I, I guess, honey, he wants a nap. Go ahead, sis. Put it down. Um, but like I was saying, y'all know we starting this new thing with our boo that we went on a date with last time, Amari, and we hit, you know, we hit it all. And everybody was trying to pull a fast one on me. Um, let's see what's going on. Is Akaya hungry? She's starving, actually. Uh, let's give her some finger food. Um, let's get a toaster waffle with some syrup and butter, baby. It's breakfast time. She's hungry. Um, so we're gonna have Cassandra feed her real quick before CPS uh, be at our door. Um, I'm sorry, SPS, Sound Protective Services. But anyway, that's what I'm saying. So, um, okay, Lila and them going on a field trip today, period. Um, my girl is up. We're gonna have her deep clean these teeth, honey. And, uh, let's see. She's still feeling some type of way about eating no microwave noodles, girl. We apologize. Um, but anyway, look, I keep getting sidetracked. So, y'all know her and Akira, it should just always be rocky with her and Akira, you know. So, they wasn't really together no more. And to my surprise, baby, even though her and Akira, even though her and Akira wasn't like together no more, the game would still recognize them as together. And I'm like, baby, no, because mm -mm, they're not together. Like, so, baby, you know what we did? We broke up with Akira via text message. We did. Because we wasn't going to give him the satisfaction of seeing him face-to-face -face and breaking up with him. Because every time we see Akira, I'm sorry, Akira face-to-face, -face, baby, it should just be, it be too much. Like, either she trying to get some, either he trying to get some, and we not trying to go backwards. So, we broke up with him via text message because I feel like if we would have been face-to-face, -face, baby, he'd have tried to talk us out of it. He just tried to sex us out of it. He, he just tried to do us. He just tried to do something to get out of it. So no, we had to nip that in the bud because we really like Amari. Like you know, we just you know they just met at the club and everything like that. And you know they went on their first date, but you know they vibed and they got a nice little connection. So we want to see where they go with Amari. Like we not trying to be hung up on Akira, right? Like. And at this point, like, Akira, I just really need Akira to get a girlfriend, y'all. Because I feel like if Akira had a girlfriend, baby, he would have somebody else to be focused on. He wouldn't be so worried about what we was doing. Like, for real. If Akira had a girlfriend, Cassandra would be the least of his worries. Um, so, is baby girl done eating or is she still, I feel like she's still eating. But she's watching the washing machine, so she's not eating the food. Or maybe she's done she, Maybe she said, girl, I don't want this last little piece of waffle. Like, just cut it out. Um, So, it's almost time for Cassandra to go to work. So, let's give her a bottle real quick before we have to head out. So, that way we won't be sending her to daycare hungry because y'all know how those daycare workers be, baby. Baby, quick to complain. Like, you sent that baby up in here hungry? Like, no. Mm -mm, no, ma'am. Not us. So, we're going to feed her before she go. Hopefully, Cassandra get up off her ass and uh, get to it. Yeah, because she had to be at work in an hour, so... Any day now, Cassandra. Like, any day. I think the reason she's not doing it, though, is because baby girl is still, like, inter yeah, she's still interacting with the washing machine and her plate. Um, so, yeah, Cassandra is going to come, and we're going to get her a bottle real quick. And then we're going to clean this up. Oh, actually, you know what? Before we do that, we're going to put her back in her bed. It's 8 o'clock in the morning, baby. Let's get Honey, he... Baby, do he got diarrhea? Because I could have sworn we just changed him. I could have sworn. You know what? That was some hours ago. Never mind. Um, we'll get to him in a second. Let me have her do that. Put her in her bed. Um, clean this up real quick. And then we'll go to the gym. Hopefully, we have time. Because it's 829. So hopefully, she has time to get that done. Um, so, also with QMBB's. Uh, express delivery baby we we got ourselves together like 
We got some iron. We got some melatonin, baby. We got some pepto bismol because you never know. Some ibuprofen, some Tylenol. She got some multivitamins, baby. She got some glucose tablets in case somebody might need them because the way this health mod work, baby, everybody keep getting diabetes. I don't know. And then we got some Dayquil. You know, we just trying to be prepared. So, it's almost time for her to go. And you know what? I don't think she's going to have time to clean that stuff up. But the at least we can do is um, change this baby diaper before she leaves. Let's change him real quick. Girl, hurry up. Go change Elijah before you got to go. It's 8.54. Well, we're not following her to work, so it's fine. She'll she'll be able to change him before she leaves. Um. So, yeah, because you like, hurry up. We're going to hit cancel because we're not going to work with her. She's going by herself. And she'll go right after she changed him. So that's perfect. We did not get her fun up, but it is what it is. And y'all, like, maybe I'm tripping, but, like, ain't it a whole ass changing table right here? Like, why is she taking him in? You know what? Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Girl, go on. Look, these babies keep peeing on us. And we finna go to work smelling pissy. You know what? I don't have time. I just I don't I don't have the time to deal with this. He just got the pee on caregiver um <laughs> milestone, of course. Um Miss Girl say baby, listen. Let me be nosy. Cause like why is y'all in here meddling with girl, you you looking over the wrong edge. You know what? Go ahead on. Go ahead on. We gon' go mad our business. Baby, she put this business attire on because she ain't come to play. Um, if I did not mention, she is in the business career. Um, uh, ma'am, ma'am, ma'am. Yeah, I'm sure. Ma'am, no ma'am. <gasps> she left. Girl, yes. Go, go pull your damn. Y'all, she was finna take the damn baby to work with her. Girl, if you don't go pull him down and stop playing with me. <laughs> but can we get into this business attire, though? Because, baby, if... If one thing we gonna do, we gonna download something about Remins, okay? And Remins is gonna get your sims together when it comes to business wear. Like, the business wear be wearing, alright? So, we're gonna have Cassandra go ahead and go to work. And then, we're gonna catch you guys when she comes back. It's supposed to came back when Cassandra got out of work. But, I had to do some prep. For this episode in the following episode so by me doing so it allowed the time to keep moving forward obviously so instead of it being friday it is now saturday um and y'all know what that mean baby on the weekend we screw up the ground y'all already know that so um it's 9 30 to 8 a.m and we is going to have her get herself together get her kids together and just really you know get her day together for her to go out tonight so she went out with the girls okay so we is going to start by having her clean up around the house a little bit baby the sink is broke we don't repair nothing we replace okay she said i don't have time for that i'm not a handyman heard you sis um so yeah we're gonna have her clean that up and then uh let's see where is the baby's situation um, Elijah needs to use the bathroom, which I'm pretty sure he's going to do. Oh, he's going back to sleep, baby. He said, I ain't got time. Akaya is surprisingly in good, uh, look at her. Her, her moves, I mean, her needs is pretty good, so. I don't know where she's going night night at, though, but girl, come on now. You know what? We are going to, let's buy, um, let's buy, like, the swing, or something for her and Elijah to share. Um, because I don't think we have room in the living room to put two. But that way she can watch TV. Because you know I got the It's Movie Time Mod by Tank. So that way she can sit in here and watch TV. Because I, I don't know y'all. It bothers me to just have these babies laying on playmats all the time. Or like even in the playpen. It just don't make sense to me. Like these babies want to sit up and watch TV now. Um, so we're going to get the swing, which is going to be so awkward for her because y'all know she know how to sit up and everything. And if you know, you know, when you put these infants in the swing and they know how to sit up, baby, it look like they finna bust their head. 
Uh, but we're gonna ignore it because sis need to be able to watch TV. So we are going to give her this swing right here. Let me make sure I don't have nothing else that I can sit her in. Though. Like we could use a car seat, but like, no. The swing is a better option. That way she can sleep in it and everything like that. So, um, yeah, we're gonna put this. Like, I, I low key want to get rid of the play piece. I'm not even gonna hold you. Like, I, I, I high key want to get rid of it. So, we're gonna put that there. Do not mind Elijah being up under this pack and play, y'all. I don't know what it is with this game that, baby, the pack and play, the kids always end up up under. I just, I just don't get it. So, we want to make it neutral. So, we're gonna get the one in the pool, and that way both babies can use it instead of it being pink. Um,. So, yeah, all right, let's put, that way Akaya can come in here because she trying to go to sleep, baby, and no, she don't need to be going to sleep. Um, could you bring baby girl in here, please? Let's put Akaya down there. And then Elijah is hungry and he needs to use his diaper. And he is really going to sleep up under the pack and play. Like, no, sir. So, we're going to have Cassandra get her real quick and then we're going to have her put, um, I'm about to sneeze. Huh. Yeah. Y'all hear that wiggling laugh. Um, okay, so we got her in the chair. Uh, let's have her go ahead and feed Elijah. And then, uh, we're gonna put him in his, his crib instead of putting him in here because, uh, don't you take her out. Girl, I'm not put. Like, y'all, I promise you, you can't. You can't put these babies down, like, and not have something already in the queue for your sim to do because, baby, they're going to pick this baby up. Like, I was trying to hurry up and click on feeding him so she wouldn't take her out of here. Like, girl, chill. I got it. Just feed him. So, we're going to turn on. Um, let's watch baby girl watch Elemental. Let's turn it on for Akaya. And girl, watch the TV. Sit back and watch this TV, girl. She ain't gonna watch it. Oh, okay, there you go, honey. Watch the TV. And then, um, yeah, so, Cassandra is about to feed him. And then we're gonna put him back in his bed. Um, because he's still tired, so. We're gonna put him down and let him go to sleep on his own. We'll put him down and then we'll play rock about baby for him. And then... Cassandra can go ahead and get her shower real quick because baby she still got on her work clothes from yesterday. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have her do that. Lila is being a responsible teen and doing her homework even though it's Saturday. Uh muddy everywhere from the mud, puddle girl, go up blood, but she's hungry. Um, so we don't know what we're gonna do with these kids, y'all. We don't know. Usually when Cassandra go out, baby. We usually send the kids either to our mom's house or they go to their dad's. But Lila could watch them. But I think we're going to have them go to Akira's house. I think that's what we're going to do. They'll stay at Akira's house. Um, so she's going to go put him down. She's going to finish her homework. After she finishes, is she going to extra credit? Oh, no, she's going to homework today. So, yeah, we're going to have Cassandra go in here and get in the tub, baby. I told you to put him in his bed, ma'am. Not on the floor. See, this is what I be talking about. This is why I don't like the play mats because common sense says put this baby in his bed. Like, girl, like, why did you even put him down there first? Y'all, the sims are so hard here. They like hard head little kids. Okay, play, turn his little. It's the remote for me. Okay, um, so she going to get in the shower, honey. Uh, Kaya is chilling. Watching her um her movie, Baby Boy is in here trying to go to sleep. Uh Cassandra's in the shower. Let's have her use some body wash. Let's let's use this dub, baby. Alright, so she used some body wash and then we're gonna have her get out and apply some DCOS Shea Butter Lotion. Cause baby, y'all know she gonna be ashy as hell. No, don't check infant. Infant is fine. We're gonna have to make that. Y'all, I need to remember to take out. Oh, she's thirsty too. I need to remember to take out the. Um, I'm sure you can feel this. Uh, the preteen mod. Like, I'm not going to The ashy, the ashy shit is irritating. Uh, what's wrong with her? She wanna go to sleep. What are you saying for? Lord, the baby's sick. Take her to the doctor. All 
Alright, so Cassandra, let's take her uh to well actually I think I have to click on a card to do it. Let's take her to the pediatrician. Cause baby, they talking about my honey got a disease. Like what disease? It's 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 too much. So we're gonna have her go to the pediatrician. Cassandra is going to take her. Uh-huh. Yeah, let me do that. Uh Lila, could you help me out, sis? Clean that up for me. Um, Lila needs to use the bathroom. She's hungry. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have her use the bathroom. Uh, we're gonna have her come and make her something to eat. Um, and then Lila needs to call her boo. So Lila is excited. Lila is excited because her going over her daddy house tonight means she get to see Demetrius because y'all know Demetrius live in the same complex as her dad. So baby, she not tripping about having to go over her daddy house. She kind of glad that Cassandra didn't say she had to babysit tonight, baby. Because anytime, she, excuse me, anytime she can get over Akira's house, baby, she's going. Okay, anytime we can get over Akira's house, we're going because that's where our man, our man, our man is at. All right. Um, so yeah, she cool with it, and Lila is super excited, you know, because she is saving up money, and you know, her birthday, she got a while before her birthday, but, like, her birthday gift for herself is she wants to redo her room, like, she wants to get her a new bed, and she wants, um, Cassandra to take her to, like, the furniture store so she can buy her a whole new bedroom set. I think the only thing she's gonna keep in here is her vanity, but, like, the bed, the nightstand, and the dresser is going to be new. Um, we think she wants to get her a bigger TV. Like, girl, period. Stack them coins and do what you got to do. Um, so, baby girl is still at the pediatrician. She's almost done. Lord, that done. I said nothing crazy. I'm going to be upset. I'm going to be upset because, yeah, this mob be playing in my face. Like, they be talking about my children got diabetes yeah, yeah. and everything. Um, okay, cool. So she's good. Okay, it's just a viral disease. Okay, it says Akaya has been diagnosed with a viral disease. Sims can treat this disease with home remedies such as herbal, green, or lemon ginger tea, orange juice, plenty of rest, as well as with over the counter medication to keep her comfortable. Viral diseases usually go away on their own, so we're gonna treat it at home, obviously. Um, I don't think we're gonna give her no medicine, no like. Uh, um, we just gonna let baby girl fight it off on her own. Unless she start getting, like, extremely uncomfortable and stuff like that, then we'll intervene. But in the meantime, in between time, baby, we're not giving her no medicine, ma'am. Uh, so we are going to have... Cassandra is going in her room, baby, because she needs to... She needs to cake. And when I say cake, that means she's gonna get on the phone and flirt with this man, Okay. Girl, leave her alone. She is fine. She is watching the movie. You go do what I just told you to do. Lila's finna eat her food. Cassandra, go, go. Go have a seat, miss. Ah, go sit down. Thank you. Um, so we are finna call our boo. Or, well, he ain't really our boo yet. We just, it's just new right now. Okay, it's just new. She calling him to see what he's doing tonight. Um, and everything like that, and, you know, he basically, I'm pretty sure he's telling her that he's hanging out with his best friend tonight, um, so, yeah, and she's like, oh, okay, that's cool, like, you hanging with the fellas, and he's like, oh, no, my best friend is a girl, and, you know, Cassandra kind of like, I'm sorry, but, like, in the back of her mind, she's like a girl, but your best friend is a girl, but, baby, she ain't the jealous type, so she not even tripping off of it, you know what I'm saying? So, you know, they just shooting they shit, and she telling him she going out with the girls tonight and everything like that. And, you know, she hope he have fun with his best friend, and hopefully she gets to meet the bestie one day. You know, and if the bestie got a man, maybe they can double date, and that's just on period. Because Cassandra is not one of those, baby. She don't be jealous of no females, because she knows she pulls these men, okay? She knows she pulls them, so that's not an issue. Um, we're gonna have her go to the bathroom. Uh, what is Akaya got going on, baby? She's still watching her movie. She wants to have, or she needs some attention. Okay, so we just gonna have Cassandra come in here and give her some attention. Lila, in the in this in the same breath that her mama is uh on the phone uh you know wait what? 
See, this is why I pause my game so much because the game be confusing me, baby. I be clicking stuff and then it be doing other stuff. Like, wait, we just wanted to use her diaper and um, Cassandra's in the bathroom still. Lila is going to talk to her mama, but actually, girl, we come down here to sit on this porch. We are mad we don't have a chair out here. Oh, wait, Lila got a chair in here that she can face her. Okay. So let's face her and Demetrius. Because we are like, baby, I'm going to my dad house tonight. So that means we get to kick it later tonight. Yeah, I'm so proud of, uh, like, um, I'm so proud of Lila. Like, Lila be out here in these streets, don't get me wrong, but not in a bad way. Like, baby, Lila goes out to eat with her friends. Anytime I play any other household, baby, Lila be out in these streets. And she is always with her friends, and she don't never be out here doing nothing she ain't supposed to. And I think that's why Cassandra lets her have so much leeway. Like, she let Lila go out, and, you know, because Lila is very responsible, she don't be smoking that we know of. She don't be, you know what I'm saying, being hot in the air. She'll be doing none of that. And I'm trying to think if Lila has introduced her to her boyfriend, but I honestly don't think that Cassandra has met Dem No, Cassandra has not met Demetrius yet. So maybe if he is outside when we drop the kids off at Akira's house, maybe she'll get to meet him. Um, so we, what we're going to do is we're going to have um, Cassandra. She's going to get ready here and then we're gonna go out from uh akaya's house i mean not akaya's akira yeah these names is, is too much uh we're gonna go out straight from akira's house so baby yes we're gonna go over there looking like a, a meal and, and and akira i already know this ain't that so don't even try it don't don't try nothing don't try nothing okay we let's give her a bottle real quick no don't pick him up So you go pick him up to go put him there. How about you put him in the swing? How, how about you put him down in here? Since you want to keep doing what you want to do instead of what I told you to do. Yeah, go put him down in the swing and then come feed your daughter and put her in her bed. Because she wants to take a nap. Like, the, yeah, I just don't be understanding the logic of behind the way the Sims take care of these infants. It don't make sense to me. It don't. Girl, I said don't go to sleep. Your mama is coming. She coming right now. She coming to feed you right now. Go get her, Cassandra, now. Okay, thank you. So, we're going to feed her real quick, and then we're going to put her... Put her... To be, to be. Okay, we're going to put her to sleep in there. Lila, on the other hand... Baby, Lila's good. Did she clean up her mess in my kitchen? Because y'all know I don't even play like that. Okay, she did. Let's see what Elijah got going. Elijah still really isn't hungry. Can he watch the TV, though? He can't. Okay, so he can watch Elemental. Um, Lila is... No, we're not practicing standing. Um, we're going to actually have Lila come and sit right here. And treat... What? Practice tea spilling. Girl, check yourself out in here. Oh, she can't do nothing in this chair. Oh, I think it's because it's okay. Hold on. So let's fix this. Yeah, I was trying to be cute with the chair, but at this point, it's looking like we're gonna have to snap the chair to the desk. Oh no, this chair don't snap. To, that's why. All right, so let's swap this chair out real quick. Let me have a sip. Okay. Um. So yeah, we is going to get her a different chair because. It does not snap to the desk. That one does, but no. We don't, we don't. That's not the vibe we're going for. Let's see. Okay, that's perfect. So we're going to get rid of her chair. I actually like this chair. Now the sneeze really did me in. I actually like this chair. Oh, and this is the book bag that Cassandra ordered her. Let me book bag. Because she wants a man. I really like this chair, though. Because we can FaceTime from this chair. So, baby, we don't keep this chair in here anyway. We can. Okay. Indeed, we are. Matter of fact, let's turn it down. Yeah, that'll work. And then her little boot bag can be right there. Um, so, yeah, that's that. Yep, we're going to keep that chair because she can FaceTime from that chair. And I really feel like that's probably the only chair in the house that we get the FaceTime option. So. Um, okay, here we go. We're going to have her sit, baby, and then uh, check yourself out. Um, and what else can we have her do? 
her mom. She knows she's pretty, okay? You need to put on no makeup, bro. Like, baby, every time you had them apply makeup, honey, they look like Ronald McDonald. She can't do that, baby. They look like Ronald McDonald. Okay, she can do that, but she can't do the other one. Okay, whatever. They be on here looking like Ronald McDonald, baby. I can't go. Um, clean that up for me. Baby, Elijah still really is not hungry. He's just watching TV. I love that for him. So, Cassandra's gonna clean this bottle up and then, um, what else she needs to do? She's pretty much clean for the most part. Oh, wait, I'm looking at that. Yeah, she's good for the most part. So, um, let's call Akira, actually. Let's call Akira. Y'all, she finally broke up with Akira. So, let's call Akira to make sure he, he cool with his kids coming over tonight let's make sure he ain't got nothing to do at this point we really don't give a shit if he ain't got nothing to do because they come in anyway <laughs> you better figure it out you better figure it out or oh, he wants some cuddles okay let's give him some cuddles oh lila finna go to work baby oh you know what speaking of which hold on let's go in strange reflection something just looks wrong for her i better say girl go get on uh, let's go to Sim Commands. Let's modify her career outfit real quick, y'all. Because they really play in Lila's face. Like, okay, first of all, my girl works at Sephora. So, why my girl got, like, she got on her everyday outfit that she got on right now. But for some reason, they put, like, purple Halloween spiderweb stockings on her. Like, no ma'am. No ma'am. Like, don't even play her like that. So, we just finna get my boo together, baby. We finna get her a cute little outfit to what work. I want to say I have Sephora t-shirts, but I'm not sure. We're going to look and see, but I feel like I do have the Sephora uniform shirt. Maybe I don't. Maybe I'm thinking about something else. I could be thinking about something else. I don't know, but yeah, we definitely is about to uh, upgrade the outfit because baby, having her walking around in purple spiderweb stockings is crazy work. I'm just saying, like... Don't even play us like that. Because we don't never... Like, look at this. Like, what? Like, no. No, ma'am. So, first of all, let's take these uh stockings off. These leggings. I'm sorry. Let's take the leggings off. And then let's find her a cute little... Like, I mean, she could wear this to work. But that's okay. Let's get that at everyday wear. So, let's find her, like, a cute little top to wear. Like I said, I want to say that I have a Sephora t-shirt, but I could be wrong. I could be very wrong. Let me see. Um, maybe we could wear something like this. Like with a little jacket. Or like just like a regular little t- Nah, no, mm -mm. This t-shirt is bringing back, um, I got trauma, y'all. The t-shirt is bringing back vibes from when... Gianna was in jail, baby. That, that's the shirt they had on. <laughs> that's the shirt they was wearing, baby. It's giving jail vibes. So, no, we don't want to wear that. Um, we just want her to wear something cute. But, like, you know, like, let's see what this hoodie is giving. Okay, this is cute. What about this one? Okay, that's cute, too. Okay. Okay, we could probably wear one of these little shirts. No, we don't want the no cut shirts. Like, okay, you know what? We want to keep it cute. So maybe we'll do like a button up or something. Like, we can do a black little button up and then let's get her some cute little jeans or whatever. Uh, let's find her some cute jeans. No, 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 they're black jeans. So we just find her some black jeans. I don't know what she wants. Uh, let's see. What we got? Um, let's see. Remy's got some really cute jeans. Like, we could even do a skirt for real. Uh, we could do a skirt. We could do a skirt or like these type of pants. This is actually cute. I don't feel like this one. Um, yeah, let me see what this is. Okay, let me do that one. Nope. Mm -mm. <laughs> I'll add. No, they're not. 
Money not all we can do these. Yeah, let's do the wild and the joints. Let's see what they got in there. Yeah. Okay, we can do this. Um, we just gonna get her some cute little shoes. I clicked on the wrong thing. We just gonna get her some cute. It's it's crazy because you can't see her feet, but we still gonna give her some cute shoes to put on, baby heels. Like, let's throw these on up under there. Yeah. Okay, so this will work. Like, she can wear this. Let's change the shirt though. I like the shirt, but let's give her some short sleeves. Um, so like we could definitely go in with you can see like this is a crop top. That's not acceptable. Yeah, that's not gonna work. Um let me see. Let me see what we got for my girl. By way of a t-shirt. Like, we want her to have a shirt that's, like, long enough. But we just want it to be short sleeves. Like, let's just get one. Oversized shirt, but it don't match with the jeans. Um, so let's see. Uh, oh, she could do, like, a tank top. But like what y'all think? Like is that too much? Yeah. Or is this I think it's cute. I think it's cute. I think it's real cute. We gonna let her wear that. And then they got rid of my baby little nose red. She ain't got no earrings on, no nothing. That's what I be talking about. Like, who decided that she was going to work like this, baby? She worked at Sephora. Okay, she is gonna look amazing. Like, the one thing about Lila, though, is, y'all, Lila really don't wear no makeup. She not even really don't. Lila don't wear no makeup. She don't. Like, my baby do definitely got a nose ring, though. Like, stop playing with her. Um, Yeah, we don't let, Cassandra don't let Lila wear makeup. And she don't need it. Like, let's be, let's be very serious. She don't need it. Like, Lila's a cute girl. She don't need no makeup. Um... Her little lip gloss be popping, and maybe all she need, baby, for the lip gloss to be lip glossing. Um, and we just gonna give her a cute little necklace. Um, so let's see. I I know I have like some initial necklaces. Let's see if we got a L for my girl. Let me see what this is. Some of these y'all be looking crazy. Yeah, we just got an L. Um, I think we gonna have. I think we gonna let her wear the L. For Lila, cause wait, um, let's change her hair, cause she always got the same hairstyle. So let's give her something different for work. Let me see. Okay, we can wear it up in a little up. Uh, see, it's something in the thing. Like, what is that? Okay, I don't know what they would. Oh, it was the hair clip. Okay, we can do like a little updo like this, or like, let me see what she look like with braids, y'all. Okay, let's give it Cleo. <laughs> It's giving a little bit of Cleo, it is, but she's still cute. Yeah, we can do the braids. Let's see what this give it. Oh, she look too grown. All right, let's give it too grown. It was cute, but it's too grown. It's too grown. Oh, she can do like a little bun. A little bun. She can do a little bun, but I actually like this one. I think this one's cute. Okay, so there we go. Boom. Now my girl won't be going to work looking crazy, okay? Because EA definitely tried us. Like, and I mean, her wearing her everyday outfit wasn't bad, but like, where the fuck did the purple stockings come from? Like, who thought that was it? Because they lied. They they really did lie. Um, So she getting ready to go to work. So actually, I think when, because I, if I'm not mistaken, Lila gets off kind of late. Like, I think Lila gets off at like 11, maybe. So, we're not going to wait for Lila to get home from work to go out. No, man. Right, so, we back in the house after changing Lila's outfit. So, that way, when she get ready to go to work, baby, she going to look presentable because they had my girl looking crazy. Uh, where the hell did Elijah disappear to? Oh. <laughs> I'm like, baby. My baby invisible. Where he at? Uh, so, it's 4 o'clock. We probably going to go drop the key at like like 7 ish. And you know what? Let's get him some lovings and some cuddles and some kisses. And then we're going to go ahead and get him a bath since he's up already. Um, let's get him some cuddles. And we're going to get him some kisses. Girl, you better not put him on that damn mat. Don't play with me, Cassandra. Don't even play with me. Like, y'all, why is she doing that? I said don't put him down there. And you going to do it, asshole. <sighs>
He don't want to talk about no ge geometry. Girl, it picked this damn baby up and stop playing with me. She is so irritating. No, we're not breastfeeding him. Look. This, this, this what I be talking about, bro. I, Cassandra. Y'all, I love Cassandra dearly. And the EP, the EP, Lord help me. The LP is everything. But, like, it, 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 it's just. So we 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 got that and, um yeah girl pick him up and do what you're supposed to do sorry I had to get my kids in order because they yelling in the background um oh he just got the toe in the mouth milestone how cute uh so we're gonna have her give him a bath like let's get these kids ready to go baby we ain't taking them over there daddy house and they ain't had no bath now oh look at my stick even though he's such a crybaby we just love him y'all uh elijah is so emotional yeah i don't know what her deal is with keep putting this baby down girl i just said give him a bath stop playing with me yeah that's it i'm i'm deleting the play mats y'all i'm done with them i'm done because it, I can't, I can't make this up. Like, you're not going to keep putting these babies down when I tell y'all to do something. Like, I'm sorry, what? So the playmats are, are, are good as gone. Next time y'all see this house, they're going to be gone. Because I'm getting rid of them. Because no, ma'am. Like, ain't no way in hell I keep telling you to do something with these kids. And you... Y'all, I know Lila didn't go to work with something to... So... Let me get this straight. We just changed Lila's work outfit. And y'all, what the fuck is this shit she got on? So they sent her to work. It's something else that we... Alright, so... Alright, you know what? I don't got no comment. I just don't. What time Lila get off? Will she be off by the time we leave? What's the four of y'all know open until one o'clock in the morning? You know what? <laughs> You know what? It, it, that's neither here nor there. We're gonna mind our fucking business, okay? That's what we're gonna do. Um. So yeah, she is going to bathe, um, Elijah, and let's see what else he needs. Like while we're at it, um, he's hungry. Okay, so we're gonna feed him after we give him his bath. Y'all remember when my game used to be so messed up that we couldn't change these kids' clothes, like, and we couldn't bathe them. Because it used to crash my game every time. Oh my god, I remember them days, baby. And now here she go, froze. Like her name is Elsa. <sighs> you know what? I'm just done with Cassandra. I'm gonna leave them be. Let's see what Cassandra is uh, possibly wearing tonight for this club adventure. Um, let's see what we wear. Um, yeah, I don't know what is going on with the milestones in my game. And it's always for them, for these particular babies. Like, baby, at this point, I'm ready to hurry up and age them up. Because the milestones are always being reset for some reason. Like, always. Like, this is not his first bath. Now, y'all done watched me play with Cassandra plenty of times. This is not this baby's first bath. Why is he getting the first bath milestone unlocked right now? This ain't this baby first bath, so I don't know what it is with them and the milestones, um, you know, being locked all over. I don't know, but I think tonight for the club, y'all, we might wear, we might wear this outfit. And it's crazy because since Cassandra went shopping, baby, and she bought some new clothes, I'm trying to make the decision on if I need to change the thumbnail pictures because in the thumbnail pictures she has on something different. And I actually want her to wear this to the club, so I don't know. Y'all may see this outfit in the thumbnail and you may not. So if you don't see this outfit in the thumbnail because this is what we wearing tonight, then yeah, it'll be all right. Same, same shit, different day. Um, so yeah, she is giving him a bath and then we're gonna feed him when he's done um and then we're gonna take him in the swing and we're gonna wake akaya up and get her ready as well and then we're gonna go drop them off baby yes it's time to go um let's feed him real quick and then we're gonna put elijah down here oh look at my skin 
he was so cute. Look, y'all, what I tell y'all, he was a crybaby, okay? Like, when I tell y'all, Elijah is a crybaby, baby, he's a crybaby. Like, I don't know why he be so upset all the time. Like, look at him, just fussing. Hush it up. Hell. We know you want a nap. We finna feed you if you stop all that fussing. Shoot. Baby, put him down here after he done. No, don't check if it. Just put, maybe that's, okay, whatever. Just put him down there after he's done eating. Um, what, we're gonna wake Miss Boo up. She's still kind of sleepy, but that's okay. Um, so yeah, we just gonna have her do that. Look, he like, girl, I'm sick of it. You gave me this damn bottle when I said I was sleepy. Yes, ma'am. He said, no, ma'am. This is not what I was asking for. Um, so yeah, we're gonna have her sure. do this. Y'all, I don't know how people play with their walls. Like, is it just me or like, I, I can't. Like, I mean, it's cute, but I just can't. Like, I need the walls cut away. Like, because when you follow them around, like, it's, it's cool to walk through the walls and stuff like that, but I don't know. I just feel like, like, look at this. Like, what? Like, you always gotta have the camera at a certain angle. And it's just, it's, it's much. Like, baby, I need to be able to see through walls. Um. Okay, girl, we finna come get you a bath. Don't worry, sis. Get her a bath. Um, Elijah is taking him a nap, yes. Y'all, look, we can't never leave on time. We are never on time. I said we wanted to leave out by 7 o'clock. It's 6.43. And we just now giving Akaya a bath. Baby, we ain't never on time. Never. So tonight, y'all, we is going out. We is not going to do a group meeting um, with the girls. We are going out with Haley, Ashanti, and Asia. That is who we're going out. Oh, look, I'm on the wrong scene. I'm like, baby, where's everybody at? Yeah, so we're going out with Haley, um, Ashanti, and um, uh, Asia. Those are the girls that we're going out with tonight. And I mean, you never know, we might see the other girls out because they know what's up. Like, baby, Saturday is the night that we go out and we shake what our mama gave us. Okay, I have to keep it cute. I just want to say something else. Um, but yeah, so we're bathing Akaya and, um, yeah, we're just gonna let her do that and she froze again, so that's gonna be a process because the time is still moving, but she's not, <laughs> it's, it's, it's really irritating. Um, so yeah, we will see you guys when we pull up at Akira's house. So we done pulled up at our oh, baby four of a house and look at this attractive attractiveness alert. Baby <laughs> Cassandra girl, I'm not even finna do this right to, with you right now. And look at him. Like he talk about baby, you look good enough to eat. Uh no, sir. Eh, 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 no. Mm -mm. So we're here and it's eight o'clock. Okay, so we made it at eight o'clock right on the nose. Um, let's go knock on this door, baby, because, yeah, uh -huh. like, we gotta go, uh-uh, Akira, go ahead on, go ahead on, stink, we not even doing that with you, and I don't know why she couldn't just hand one of the babies to Akira, but y'all know how EA do shit, so, that's okay, we gonna have Elijah, we gonna have Elijah get picked up by his dad, because she clearly just put this baby on the ground, so. Um, let's come over here to Akira and have him come pick Elijah while we knock on his door. Um, okay, we're just gonna say help. <laughs> He's like, daddy, help, please, mom ain't shit. Alright, so, um, y'all already know what type of time we is. We don't stay long, baby. Mm -mm. Put Akira, you know what, put Akaya down right here, baby. Whatever Akaya get into while she in her daddy house, that's between her and her daddy, baby. We just can't even drop them off. Because, baby, we look good and, and, and it's time to go. Okay? Yeah, go, go ahead and sit her down, baby. Okay. Let's let's get her a little kiss. Don't, don't start the last the girl stuff. Don't start. Let's get her a little kiss before we go, baby, and then we're leaving. Um, we gonna give my stink a little smooches and then we're gone. Hopefully, uh, 
he brings him and get the character. Five kill. There we go. He's upset that he's mad. He's mad as hell. Um, so yeah. Cassandra's about to call the girls and see if they meeting at the club. And let's see who we calling. Let's call Haley. Make sure they ready, baby. We be late for everything. We be late for everything. Let's let's tell our our baby father thank you for for keeping his kids tonight and everything like that. And we gonna give him a little hug, y'all. I don't, even though I really don't trust hug and the girl, but we gonna give him a little hug. <laughs> baby, he gonna get the wrong idea. Okay, she like girl. I just dropped these kids off with a kid her ass, and he over here thinking he about to slip in his skirt, but it ain't going down. It ain't going down, cause this ain't that. Look, he don't know what to do with himself, y'all. <laughs> uh, Kira don't know what to do with himself. He like, bro, I need to go in the other. Okay, look, let me get my thoughts together. Girl, no, ma'am, that's not what I just asked you to do. Like, I understand you're a mother, but girl, that's not what I just asked you to do. I asked you to give your baby father a hug so we can go. Because we know we looking like a snack, baby. You better not pick that baby up. I'm just... Okay, you tell me your baby good night. Okay, I appreciate that. Could you just put him back, please? We don't even want to hug or care no more. Now we just want to leave. Baby, he in there watching Black China. We got to go. We leaving. The girl said that we, that, that we meeting at the club. We ain't going to meet at nobody's house, baby. We meeting right at the club. So that's what we doing. Akira, baby, thank you for watching these kids. Um, and, and that's just that on that. So we're going out with Ashanti. We're going out with Haley. And um, we're going out with Asia. Um, because, yeah, this this is not... It, it's not giving at this point. Like, sis just keep doing what she want to do, baby. He was fine. Like, what was your reason for picking him up? That's what I be talking about. Cassandra do what she want to do when she want to do it. Cassandra be on the do what the fuck she want to do show instead of do what the fuck I told her what to do. Uh-uh, uh-uh, wait. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. No, ma'am. See, they thought... They thought we was finna travel with these babies, y'all. Now, watch how they do me. Watch how they do me. So, that was my mistake because when I just hit travel, the, the babies was selected. So let's do this again. Hey, uh, no, no, not Gianna. Haley. Where did Shanti go? Ashanti. Unselected babies. Asia. Unselected babies. Okay, boom. I think that's where we always went wrong before, y'all. Because remember when we used to go out, after we dropped them off, the babies would always be outside the club. And I just realized, I think that was my fault that they was always at the club with us because I didn't unselect them. There we go. So she's going out with the girls, baby. I mean, we are going to Del Sol Valley, and we're going to the Ultra Lounge, and we will see y'all when we get there. And as you can see, it's already some side eye going on. Um, but let's see who was up in here, because the girls need to know. So we're going to take a peek over here. Okay, the fellas is in that section. We see y'all. Okay, we see Imani and him, and look at Cruz and his girlfriend. Like, first of all, don't be flicking me out, baby, because I ain't even did nothing to y'all, okay? And up in the VIP, the girls is girling, okay? Everybody looking cute or whatever. And yeah, like, that's just that on that. So, like, let's get up in here because, you know, we're going to talk about why everybody looking how they looking. As she should. <laughs> But there's one problem, you know, sis is ignoring the fact that Derek is up here by the DJ booth, and that ain't the only issue, y'all. Derek girlfriend Jayla is here, and y'all know we already ain't even tight feeling Jayla because Jayla had some words for us about Derek, baby, and this ain't this. So, like, we is definitely gonna address the situation, like, in here five minutes, y'all, and... Cassandra is arguing with Derek girlfriend while Derek up there shaking it. His ex girl and his new girl is steady getting into it, but you know her girls is right here, like Asia right here. I don't know where everybody else went, but y'all know Cassandra told her it was on site. So we gonna see how this play out, baby. And Derek don't give a damn. 
baby Derek just watching it but Cassandra's telling her like girl you was talking all that big shit on the phone and ma'am you ain't about that life look she said girl what like I told you when I seen you it was on sight like I'm on that type of time and, and Jalen walked away y'all Jalen walked away oh so they gonna come sit down and have a talk she like, look, I'm going to pull you to the side, and I'm going to tell you because I don't want to cuss you out in front of these other bitches. Girl, Cassandra's reading this girl for filth, baby. She is. And, and we don't blame her because, y'all, Jayla really tried to play us. Like, we tried to reach out to Derek. I don't know if y'all remember, but we tried to reach out to Jer Derek, and, like, Jayla intercepted the text messages and shit. And, baby, she was talking to a big boy. And, look, Cassandra, like, I don't trust this bitch. Like, and, and don't. And don't, but like, what is what is what else we need to say? Oh, oh Lord, y'all. Oh Lord, Cassandra, Cassandra beating the girl up, y'all. Oh my God, we going to jail, baby. We is going to jail. Do you hear me? Oh Lord, Cassandra, girl. It, well, it is what it is, y'all. It is what it is. It ain't even no surprise because Cassandra told her. Baby, when I see you, it's on sight. You got on that man's phone, and you was running that mouth, and now you had to pay the consequences. And you know, Cassandra don't even really be trying to be on this type of stuff, but Shorty was testing our G-car, and we had to let her know, like, no, ma'am. Like, first of all, we don't even want Derek. We was just still trying to be friends with Derek, and you think because y'all together and we used to mess around that we want him. Baby, we don't want Derek. We got us a, a fan, little Hershey kiss, okay? We don't want Derek. So, Cassandra came out to the club with her girls. Baby, they done got to twerk just a little bit. Just a little bit. And, and, and Jayla and Derek in here, like, everything sweet. But Cassandra had to stand on business, baby. Because we told her we see her. It was on site. And that's just what it was. So, we about to get back into enjoying our night. Jayla is going to have the walk of shame and get up out of here. And that's just that on that. Girl. Baby, we done pulled up to the IHOP. Like, my girl done worked up Appetite. So, the IHOP is, like, literally right across the street from the club. And we just finna order us some food, baby. Because, listen, it's been a very eventful night. So, we is here with Ashanti, um, Asia, and Haley Steele. But, I don't know if y'all peeped. Elena was definitely in the VIP section. She was at the club. So, her and, um... Adriana decided to come with us to IHOP. So, what we are going to do before we even get into talking about what took place in the club tonight, baby, we finna order this. So, Cassandra's finna order for the table because y'all know how I do. Before we talk about anything, we're going to order food. So, um, baby, she said, listen, she needs some calm and chamomile after this, baby. <laughs> she, she needs to calm down, okay, because she is on one. So, everybody else is going to have orange juice and, yeah, let's order some food. Um, so, let's see. Cassandra says she going to keep it cute, baby. She just going to have her some fried eggs and toast. Um, but, yeah, the other girls, baby, we just going to randomize it. We just going to pick what we pick. The big steak omelets. Um, somebody is going to have a original buttermilk pancakes, baby. Let's do some strawberry banana. Um, and let's do a spinach and mushroom. There we go. Boom. Everybody got something to eat ordered. And yeah, so like the girls is like confused, baby. They like, girl, we knew you had beef with Shorty, but we didn't know it was that bad. Like, we didn't know you was going to be up in the club putting hands and feet on her. And I don't know why they surprised. <laughs> I don't know why they surprised. You know, we, we don't know why y'all surprised. Like, because girl, this girl tried us about Derek. And we had to let her know that this ain't that. Like, look, she said, baby, it's a small world. I didn't know they was going to be in the club tonight. But it had to be done. And that's just that. So, like, we is going to enjoy our meal and, you know, they is going to talk and everything and wait for the food to come. And, like, that's just what we're going to do because we going to ask the girl, though, like, how they been because we ain't hung out in a while. So, let's ask Asia how her day was today, like, how she been. 
oh, he's here to take cool. over. She's like, okay, Vanessa this is going to be wrong. Vanessa this is going to be wrong. I'm going to make it up. So we just going to go around the table and pretty much ask all our girls how they been because we haven't seen them in a while. We've been busy with this new job and everything like that. So we just going to, yeah, I don't know what Cassandra's looking at. She's looking off into the sunset. Her cigar for bae. Um, so <laughs> yeah, nice. let's ask Elena how she been. So we just going to go around the table and ask everybody how they been. Um, and let's ask Kaylee how her day was. So we already asked Ashanti how her day was. Somebody else, Adriana is supposed to be at the table with us, but I really don't know where Adriana was. Um, so yeah, we gonna ask Kaylee how she been, and for real, we wanna ask Kaylee, like, girl, what's tea? Because we know what's going on, you know, we gonna have a deep conversation with Haley, okay? We're gonna have a deep conversation with Haley because, baby, everybody around the town know that Haley fiance is fucking with Summer Holiday, and we just trying to understand why she stayed, like... Everybody around the town know that Tequavion and Summer Holiday be meeting up at the Hotel Motel Holiday Inn. And we just trying to understand why Haley is still with him. Like, because, girl, you is fine as fuck. You don't have to deal with that. Like, you're pretty as hell. She's like, girl, look, spill the tea. Because, like, as you plotting on him, let us know because we'll pull up. Look, she said, baby, if you plotting, let us know and we'll pull up. Like, we got your back. Because why are you sticking beside him, you know? She like, girl, you already know I got a little plan in motion. She say, baby, don't even worry about it. And Lena like, but you got to think about the baby because you know they got Corey. They got they got girl, Elena is always the, the one that's trying to make everything make sense. Girl, fuck all that. Ah, no, ma'am, he cheating. He needs to be dealt with accordingly. Like, and that's just that on that, like, on period. So, we is waiting for our food, and Asia is talking about going back to school, and... Cassandra just really enjoying herself, but you know, Cassandra is enjoying herself, and really, the reason Cassandra wanted to come out tonight was kind of to try to take her mind off of what she really got her mind on. Like, she can't get past the last time they was at the club. Like, outside of her meeting, her new little Hershey Kiss bowl, um, Amari, you know. Outside of that, she still can't get past the girl that she's seen sitting at the bar. Like, Cassandra is really, her mind has been occupied with that. Like, she really want to know who this girl is. Like, everybody kept saying, you know, all her friends were telling her that her and this girl look alike and everything like that. So, like, she is really wondering what's tea. Like, and y'all, why the fuck did her mom and daddy just pull up to the IHOP? Like, <laughs> Like, we can't be at the IHOP and not speak to our mama and daddy. So, like, we gonna come over here and say hi to our mama and daddy. But, like, what is y'all doing outside at 4 o'clock in the morning? Like, what what are y'all really doing out? But, you know what, that ain't even no question to be asked because y'all know Papa Judas and Big Eleanor be out here in these streets, baby. So, like, let's come over here and give our mama a hug. Because, like, girl, why is you at the IHOP, baby? Let's come over here and talk to our mom and daddy real quick. Because what? <laughs> I'm weak. Like, not they pulled up. But, yeah. So, that's just kind of where her mind been occupied. And it's so crazy that we noticed her parents being in here eating at this time while we thinking about this. Because her parents, you know, she really feel like she wants to go and tell her parents, like, you know, mom and dad, I was out a couple weeks ago. And I seen this girl at the club, and I swear, like, we could be twins. Like, but she think it's crazy. Like, in her mind, she think it's crazy. Like, you know, why would this girl look like me? Like, it's just a coincidence. Y'all just, you know, she just chucking it up to her friends. Like, you know, they two light brights, two light-skinned baddies. They look alike, you know. And I think that's what Cassandra really is, is, is chucking it up to, like, her head is kind of been in the clouds, and she really want to get to the bottom of it. Like, not even to the bottom of it, because we don't know if it's something to get to the bottom of just yet. You know, she just really want to know who the girl is. Like, she don't know the girl name. She don't even know the girls that she was there with. Like, so she don't know where to start to try to at least figure out the girl name or, like, you know, anything like that. So, Cassandra is just really hoping... That was the real reason we came out tonight. Like, the real reason we came out tonight is because we was hoping to see the girl at the club again. But, you know, 
no luck. She wasn't there tonight. But Jayla ass was, and we is okay with that. You know what I'm saying? So our food, this should be our food right here. Hopefully this is our food, y'all. It is not our food. We just knew this was going to be our damn food. They always taking all that. Look at Nancy laying grab back there in the kitchen, baby. Nancy better not ever try to act like she better than nobody ever in life. Because, baby, we know your secret. You work at the motherfucking International House of Pancakes, baby. You better not ever be acting snooty around nobody. Because we're going to pull your card, Miss Ma'am. But let's talk to Elena. Like, let's ask Elena how school been doing. Because if I'm not mistaken, Elena is still in school. So let's talk to Miss Elena and ask her how school is going. Like... We missed our girls, and we just want to talk, so, like, let's ask her. Let me see. Let's do some small talk. Um, I wonder if we can ask her about school. Um, we gonna ask how are you. Like, let's see how she's doing. Like, how school been going for her, everything. Like, she should almost be done. You know, she live on in a sorority not a sorority house she live in a dorm house she said i am kind of down but thanks for asking oh stink what's the matter oh my god y'all everybody at the table is just going through life baby life is life and for these girls um usually i hop is pretty quick at bringing the food but baby they slow tonight mm -hmm. they slow they slow listen let me get it together they slow tonight um Let's have a deep conversation. Like, let's ask her why she down. We want to know what's going on with Elena. Like, girl, what's up? Why are you down? Like, what's wrong? She like, girl, I'm stressed out. I got finals. It's just, it's a lot. She like, but I appreciate you asking. You know, because don't nobody never ask me how I'm doing. Look, she checking her phone. She like, let me see if my man texts me. Girl, it's 6 o'clock in the morning. Let me man text you. Uh, well, while we is waiting on our food to come, um... And which that is probably our food. We gotta go to the bathroom. Let's go to the bathroom real quick. Let's go pee. Um, so hopefully that. Oh my god, that is still not our food, baby. I know y'all two is lying. I know y'all like. Oh my god. I'm not even gonna talk about what's going on right now. I'm not even gonna talk about. You know what, y'all. We decided we don't even want the food. We don't even want the food because of the shit that's going on in the kitchen. At this point, baby, we finna give up our table. Um, Yeah, we don't even want the food. We about to leave. We about to go pick our children up, y'all. And we will see y'all back at the house. Because if this is the type of tomfoolery that goes on in the IHOP back here in the kitchen, baby, we don't want to eat here. So we gonna catch y'all back at the house. He is... Um, let's see what they need to look like. Um, okay, the cheering is fine. So, we're going to have Cassandra put, um, Elijah in there and put Akaya in her bed. And she is going to take her, uh, shower. Um, and she just, I feel like she just want to reflect for the rest of the night, baby. I don't even think we got no wine in the refrigerator. Yes, I say refrigerator. Yeah, I don't even think we got no wine because, baby, she needs to unwind. Okay, it's too much. It's just way too much. Um, let's see what Lila got going on. Lila needs to go pee. So Lila went. You know, she was excited to go over her daddy house. She got to see her boo or whatnot. Um, we're gonna have her go and use the bathroom and take a shower real quick. Before she go to sleep, uh, Cassandra, any day now, uh, come on, girl, D just do what I said, put these kids to bed, we're gonna reset her, because she just be doing too much, baby, girl, look, there you go, babies is put down, Jesus, criminy, right here, put, put Elijah in his bed, and put Akaya in her bed, please, if you don't mind. Um, thank you. All right, we're going to speed this up a little bit. But, yeah, it, it, it's been an eventful night, baby. We went to the club to have fun, to take our mind off of this life. And, baby, drama just happened to arise. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then, you know, we went to 
I have after the club because we wanted to have some food, baby, and it just was giving a hot ghetto mess. Is what it was giving. It, it was. It, it was giving a hot mess. It was because, baby, listen. Why in the hell? When we get to the IHOP, baby, we pull up to have some food, and the folks is in there getting busy. Do you hear me? Like, the folks is in there getting busy in the kitchen of all places. Uh-uh, no, ma'am. Uh-uh, no, ma'am. Leave, leave her be. Go take your shower. Thank you. And then I understand you tired and all that, Miss Girl, but yeah. So, like, y'all, it's, it's crazy. It's just really crazy to us, like... Um, we went to the club to have a good time and take our mind off of what we've been thinking about here lately and have fun with our friends. And of course, Jayla and Derek is in attendance and y'all shit went left. It went left, but it's all right because we not tripping. We not face wash. We not tripping off of nothing because Jayla had that shit coming. She did. Jayla had that shit coming. She knew she had that shit coming. And it was only a matter of time before some shit took place. Um, We need her to eat something, y'all. Like, go eat something real quick. Eat, yeah, eat a bowl of cereal. Girl, I know you tired, but we need her to eat something. So she's going to eat, and then we're going to have her come in her room. Just so she can be by herself, y'all. Because Cassandra don't be trying to be on, you know, drama. She don't. But if drama find her, she with the shits. Like, let's not be mistaken. She with it. Like, if drama finds her, she's with it. Lila finna ask her mama, like, girl, did you have fun tonight? Like, did you and your girls have a good time? Let's see if Cassandra gonna tell Lila she got into a fight. She might not tell her, y'all. She might not tell Lila she got into a fight because she don't want Lila to think that, you know, being on that type of stuff is okay. You know what I'm saying? She don't, Lila's a good girl. So we don't want Lila to think like out here fighting and everything like that is is where it's at. So Lila can ask her mama like, girl, did you have fun? She like, girl, I'm tired. Look, she is avoiding the question. <laughs> she said, girl, yeah, I had so much fun. I'm tired. The thing, Cassandra is finishing her finish our cereal. Um, Lila's needs are pretty okay. So they just gonna sit here and chat her. Yeah, she like, look, mom, it's been raining. I don't know what's up with the weather and everything like that. Y'all, I just love Lila and Cassandra's relationship. Like y'all know this, they always match it and always pretty much got on the same colors and everything. Girl, didn't right tell you to take this water out of your inventory, let alone sit the bottle on the floor. She keep be doing whatever. Lila, like, all right, mama, good night. I'm going to my room. I don't know, Lila said, baby, I'm going to get something to eat. Oh, girl, go ahead then. Baby, we, oh, she cleaning. Baby, go ahead. She said, this Sunday reset, baby. I'm about to clean this kitchen. And, and that's just that. So, like, we're going to have Cassandra come and finish her cereal in her room. She She's going to come sit here. Because, you know, before Cassandra goes to bed, we just need to think about some stuff. So, like, let's look through her pictures and try to find the picture of the girl from the club, y'all. I don't know. That's the picture from tonight. Um, girl, you too damn big to be sitting in that bed like that. Oh, look at Miko. She told me, hey, I heard you became enemies with Jayla Briscoe. That girl's a jerk. And is. And is. <laughs> and we know this. So let's see if we can find the picture of the mysterious girl from the club, y'all. We don't know her name. We don't know where she lived. We don't know where she's from. We don't know nothing. Like, and I'm just trying to find a picture of the girl, but I don't know where it is. Oh, Cassandra, she took a picture of this girl, y'all, when we was at the club and we seen her. And everybody pointed her out. We took a picture of her. But, like, I don't see it. Oh, my God. Did we get rid of the picture by mistake? So, now, like, we really don't have to try to see this girl around somewhere. Yeah, because we don't see it. Oh, my God. You guys, the picture is gone. 
Cassandra had the picture of this girl and it's gone. We don't have it, so we don't know. Like, we don't know what could have happened to the picture. We don't know if she deleted it by accident. Like, we don't know. So now we just have to try to find this girl, like, out and about. Like, we just got to hope that we see her out somewhere because we don't have her picture no more. Uh um. So, like, y'all, my good sis is sleep on the couch. Lila is back watching TV. And, you know, at this point, I think we just going to end it here. Like, Cassandra went out, and her real reason behind going, y'all, I don't know what's up with Lila. <laughs> but, yeah, her reason for going out tonight was to, you know, hopefully take her mind off of what she's been thinking about, trying to find out who this mystery girl is. But she also kind of went out tonight because, like I said, we wanted to see if maybe we saw her out. And, unfortunately, we didn't see her, and then we got into a fight at the club, and now we, you know, we was okay with being friends with Derek after the breakup. But baby, at this point, Derek can kick rocks and make mud. We threw with Derek. Derek can't never speak to us. Derek been not pop up at my house because, you know, we were still friends. So he would pop up. He would text. He would call. We don't want no communication with Derek at all. Because we know now that being friends with Derek is going to bring drama. Okay? And that's not what we own. And we want to focus on this new man in ways. Okay? So, like... We gonna end this part with Cassandra going out and she exhausted, baby. And we just hope the next time that we step out on the scene that we can get some information about this girl because we really want to know. Like, we want to know who she is, you know. And in this next part, we'll be aging up Akaya. And, you know, Cassandra made the decision that, you know, we think we want to invite our new boo to Akaya's birthday party because he does have a daughter, the kids. So she's okay with him bringing his daughter to the birthday party. So in this next part, we will definitely be aging Akaya up and Cassandra will get to meet his daughter and he will get to meet her kids. So that'll be fun. Um, But yeah, baby, we want to get to the bottom of the mystery girl because at this point, it's like really consuming Cassandra's mind. So hopefully in the next part we see her out somewhere or maybe one of the girls you know maybe one of our friends that found out something at least her name so maybe we can look her up on social media see if she got a twitter or like you know what i'm saying or maybe find out where the girl hang at because ain't nothing like your man being consumed by a mystery baby okay so i will see y'all in the next part bye